even just waking up here on your Monday morning. You set aside 45 minutes. Guys, if this is your first time here, what's up? My name is Megan. I am a Legree and Reformer instructor out in Orange County, California. We're gonna go ahead and kick off that week. Set that time, that tempo. I'm gonna square us off just a tad a bit more. There we go. Okay, there was like little like OCD things I can't. All right, so equipment for today. I'm gonna go ahead and go over that equipment and then we're gonna go ahead and get started right here. So go ahead and grab, we got three pieces of equipment for me here today. If you don't have resistance tubes, you're gonna go ahead and pick up some hand weights for me, whatever that looks like. So everything we're doing with this resistance tube right here, you're gonna be able to do with those hand weights or if you got a set of ankle weights on one of them because we do have a scrambled eggs, that's just an option there. So that the resistance tube is on that. And then for bands, I have my extra heavy band right here. Um, so we're gonna hit that baby skating, but we're gonna grab this one here. It's a fabric band if you have rubber bands, works too. But this one is like the one that when I try to move it, it's going practically nowhere with my arms. But those legs are nice and strong and we're gonna target into those there. So that's that baby skating. And then last but not least, we got that lightest band you got. I want you to grab your lightest one, extra light, whatever it looks like. We're gonna go ahead and use this for one of our leg exercise as well. Hit some of that upper body. So just that, three pieces of, oh, I lied. Where are my discs, my sliders? I cleaned them off. <laughs> I was like, wait, that looks so wrong. Okay, last but not least, we use these sissy sliders all the time. I think it's just because you're never gonna do a class with me where we aren't gonna use some sort of slide that goes across this here, so those are just self-explanatory. Those go into it again every time. So those are going on the floor. I got a towel, got a water. I'm gonna grab that sip before we get started. Now, if you guys have never done a Legree or a Pilates-inspired type class, it's slow, controlled movement where we're gonna be isolating throughout the entire body throughout the whole workout. We're gonna start onto the floor right here. I'm gonna grab that last little sip of energy. All right, comments go off, music goes up. We got 45 minutes starting on the clock right here, guys. Okay, good morning. Knees down onto that mat. Hands are going onto that disc. We're going right into a kneeling crunch for me here. So what you're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and pair it up real quick. You're gonna meet me in a modified plank position, modified push up right here. Hold it, shoulders out of the ears, core and tight. All right, now I want you to almost think of this like a little cat-cow action to get that body warm. You're gonna tuck the chin to the chest, curl round through that spine up to pull it up for four. Three, two, hold, now slowly take it right back out. Reach it, hold, stop into that modified push-up position, then re-curl it up. Squeeze, squeeze, good you guys. Now if you aren't moving with those disco sliders, maybe you got those washcloths right here. I'm gonna join you on that dish towel. That works perfectly right here. You can just use a towel onto the floor. Using something that drags, something that squeezes against it right here. That works just as well. So what we're doing is those hands are planted down. Curl up, squeeze, round lift. Feel almost like someone's punching you in the stomach right here. So that as that belly button folds in half, the chin tucks to the chest, the, chin, the shins are pushing down into the floor. All right, we got 15 seconds, just left right here. Jog through, curl up, up, squeeze. Now you always have that option as well to do one hand at a time. So if it's ever too intense on that movement, taking in one hand at a time for your last 10. One more, meet me all the way at the top, round it up in three, two, hold it, push away with the hands, find a stretch between the shoulder blades. As we send it out for eight, we're gonna find that full wheel, but I'll reach those hands out, reach it long in three, two, hold it out, now digging back and in. The low abs are locked in, holding into that still modified push-up position. So we're no longer bending, we're no longer curling at that waistline. We're holding into that long extended plank position. Shoulders are out of the ears, core is in nice and tight. As you inhale, it's now four. Three, two, hold, exhale, drag it back and in. And squeeze, feel like you're pulling those lats down by the side of the body. Guys, you guys, you got this here, just another 15 seconds. Woo, 
Pull it in. There we go. Core starts to warm up. Shifting every time you use that breath. We're finding that slow momentum. So what that pace is, that pace means that we're just using every little inch to resist through the movement. So I want it out for Take it out for three, two, pull, pause. Now you come in at 0.1 mile an hour. Bring it in, feel every inch right there. Cause this next one we hold together, take it out in six. Push it, reach it, hold it there in three, two, hold it there, shoulders out of the ears, core and tight. Stay right there, hang on to it, breathe it out. Yes, you can, one more inch. Woo, we got this here for five. There we go, stay with this. We're going right into that super crunch feet to disc in three, two, one. Pull it in right back in, booty goes down. Feet go to that disc, you slide it, hinge it out, reach, hold. Chin goes up, away from that chest. So I want you to find that long spine so that as you inhale, we're reaching up to the ceiling. We're not folding, we're not bending in half. The shoulders stay behind the hips. That breast stays going here. Woo. Okay. Monday. Slow it down. Slow it down right here. That heart rate's starting to pick up. We're starting to feel that control that has to come from the center abdominals, but we're also starting to feel that mental strength, that strong mind that's got to remind yourself exactly what you're working for right here. New week, new goals. Here's that time to set it in, lock it in. Give yourself full 45 minutes, start to finish, you got this. We got eight, Woo. abs start to fire up. Dig through those heels, yes you can. Stay on to it here, push it out, three, two, hold it there, shoulders out of the ears, core tight. Down an inch, hold. Down two, pause, take it up, little inches up, hold. Up two. Because you guys, right here, so when we use those two inches, we're gonna be hitting those quite a bit during class. Where I'm gonna ask you to move an inch, hold, pause. Move an inch, hold, pause. Send that mind to muscle connection. Little squeezes through this here, full range in three, two, down first, down first. Go for it, reach it lower, pull it back and in. In, squeeze, remember level one, you can always slightly assist with those hands right behind you here, but I need you to be fighting for that core to stay active last 10 seconds. Because you guys, one more as you take it in. We're gonna go ahead and pull the feet off of the disc, take it onto the back, you give me that upside down bear. Give me that plank in three, two, hold it here. Shoulders out of the ears, core tight, feet are out. Level one, drop the shoulders back. Level two, hold them up, bend the knees, bend them in, stop them before the hips. Take them out right here. So what I want you to feel is that inhale, squeeze, scoop, hold. Exhale, reach, reach it. Breathe, take it back, go squeeze. Two, three, stop the knees before those hips. If you need to put those hands right here, right above those hips, so that as the knees come in, your quads never hit the hands. Stop it sooner, reach it out. Woo, 15 seconds, there we go. Come on Monday, burn it out, curl with those low abs, get the shoulders up a little bit more. Slow the legs even just a little bit more. Pull that belly button down through the spine. Hold it up for me. Woo, hold it out in three, hold it two, one, hit that upside down plank. All right guys, we're gonna flip this plank over. Onto the floor, toes to disc. You got a plank to pipe to finish out these abs. In five, in four, three, two, woo! Here we go, feet to disc, hands to floor. Shoulders out of the ears. Are you ready? Let's go. Lift those hips up, squeeze the feet together. Three, two, let's go. Climb it up, four. Woo! Three, two, hold, take it right back out. Slow everything right here, right back to that four count. Let's go four Mississippi's up for four. Drag for three, two, push away with those hands. Now slowly take it right back out. All right guys, so plank to pipe. We're squeezing those inner thighs, ankles, toes together. Reach the crown of the head, heels opposite direction. As the tailbone goes up, the crown of the head goes opposite. Look back between the toes, between the calves. Right here. Those arms are getting nice and strong. Full body. Push away like you're at the top of a push up. And breathe. If you haven't already done it, I need you to pick a word 
Something that's going to be your mantra for class. Something that's going to be your intention for this week, maybe. But every time you come into one of these workouts, every time you meet yourself with a challenge, you remind yourself where the strength shows up. Woo, last 10 seconds, hold out that plank in five. Meet me in that plank. Even if you took a rest, we be here in three, two, hold. Final 15 seconds, just hold. Squeeze. Breathe, roll the shoulders out the ears, more tight, yes you guys, so good. Monday, we kick it off left leg first. We kick it off left foot, coming in, escalator. Left foot to that mat. Three, right foot to that disc. Two, one, come on, bring it right here. Okay, left foot to the mat. My right foot goes onto the disc. Send it all the way down, meet me at the bottom in three, two, hold it down. Shoulders out of the ears, hips are squared. Now, we're not gonna stand through our front left leg. What you're gonna do for me is you're gonna drag through that front left heel. So stick some chewing gum underneath that left heel. Now I need you to scrape it off like you're scraping it off onto that cement. Pull up for four. Scrape it up, pull back for three. Two, stop before the top, reach it right back down. As you reach down, I want you to push away like you're pushing that mat in front of you all the way till you come to that 90, then drag, pull it back underneath you. So an escalator lunge, if we were on a mega former, your left foot, that standard weighted foot, would be on a moving carriage. So how we gotta simulate that is you gotta imagine pushing that left foot out and away. Push it away, push it away, drive it long, hold it at the bottom. Wiggle the left toes, dig the heel in now, pull it back, drag. Squeeze, feel the hamstring, that's what activates the hamstring. That's what pulls us right, your chest stays up tall. Take it out. Woo! Breathe it, reach it. Take it, here we got 15 seconds. You're gonna meet me down. In just another eight, start to work your way down. Here we go, four, hold it down. Two inches, three, two, let's go, up an inch, hold. Back foot does not move, press it up, two, pause. Do it again, go down, go breathe. For two, hands off those hips, let's go, lift. Take it here, woo, feel that heel connect. Feel that drive through the back of the leg. Stay right here, you've got 15 seconds, go low, breathe, low, breathe. Do it again, press. Good, you guys, that heart rate starting to come up. Last six. Meet me down and hold. Reach those arms, because full range. Three, two, six, count six. No faster, four. For three, two, stop there, turn it right back around. All right, second set of full range. We know what this looks like right here. Can we add the arms to bring up the heart rate a little bit more? You gotta kick off Monday strong right here. Let's go. Send yourself down focus. Take care of that self-care right here. Everything you got, drive through. Push through. Stop before the top. Nice, you guys. We hold it down in four. Hold it down. We go right into that moonwalker in three. Bend that back knee in in two. One. Hold in. Drag it in. Hold 90. Push it right back out. Woo. Squeeze it. Do it again. Pull it right back in. In. Squeeze. Hold. Do it again. Reach it out. Reach it out. Breathe. Yes, you can. Squeeze it in. Come on. Stay with it. Stay with it. Final 15 seconds. No holes, no pulses, just one more all the way in. In, hold. As we get ready to push it out, we find that heavy resistance band. You meet me. Woo! Baby skating on the left in three, two, one. Okay, heaviest resistance band comes right around the quad. I want you to find that sweet spot, middle of the quad. It should feel like you're putting on a tight, fresh wash pair of jeans. Take it off. Now. Right foot, left foot. Nice and narrow right here. We're gonna push off and away from that left glute. Slowly pulling it right back in. Keep that right knee outside of that toe. Woo. Okay, so baby skating. A few things you're gonna be really, really cautious 
options up for me here. We are sitting into the outside of that left heel. That left big toe does not get heavy. So my left side stays stacked, shoulder, hip, knee, toe. Now into that hold, I'm not squatting crazy low. What I'm doing is I'm giving a soft enough bend that when I push through the outside of that left heel away, it sends that little connection to the top of the booty. Pull the abs in. Woo, there we go. Good, you guys. So whenever I'm in class, I always like to cue it. Put on those favorite pair of high-waisted jeans. Put your left hand where the back pocket would be. That's where I need you to connect to right here. So that as we push, keep the right knee outside of that hip. It's called baby skating because it's small. You might be moving three to four inches, and that's where you're gonna get the most work. To create that time under tension, to create that press, press, squeeze, slowly taking it back in, inch by inch, breathe it back out. Woo! Hang on to it, guys, you guys, you got it right here. Staying in control, staying focused into that movement. Don't let the left toe get heavy. Pull it in, stack yourself. Now, if you're using that edge of the mat right here, again, I like to use that edge of the mat to draw that center line. Slow it down, even just a hair more. Woo, we get ready, take it out halfway, in four. Halfway, in three, two, deep breath in, sit down an inch. Deep breath in, push it out one. Do it again. Take a deep breath in, sit down an inch. Woo! Deep breath in, push it out an inch. Two inches right here. Final 20 seconds. Little two inch pushes. Push, drive, do it again. Take it in, hold. In, breathe. Out, push. Woo, so strong, right onto this here. Right onto that movement. We fight it out, we keep it right into this. We're gonna stay with the outer glute outer thigh, but we're gonna take it all the way down to the mat. We got a mega donkey kick. Woo! On the left and four. Light resistance band comes around that right knee, left foot in three, two, one. Take it up right there, here we go. So I'm gonna take that light resistance band. You can start with it around both feet, then put your right knee through. Come into that tabletop, kick it out. Push it along. Squeeze it in. Breathe right here. So if it's easier to put it around both feet, you have that option. I really like it with the band around the front of my right knee. I feel like it mimics that mega former so well. Pushing in, pushing out, adding that tension all the way into that 90 degrees. Reach the crown of the head long.
in eight. One more. One more. We get ready. Bicep curl with that super lunge in three, two, one. All right, kick that light resistance band off. Grab that resistance too. Left foot forward, right foot back drop low. Low. Hold. Now, if you got hand reach, you're still mimicking this movement. You're giving me that bicep curl right here. Reach it out. But you guys remember, you can always put a light resistance to band underneath and pull from underneath as well. That's totally there for you. Either way, you get there. Move with me. That time is on. Let's go. Hover the knee. Take it back up. Stand. So you're in a split lunge at the bottom of this. So when we come down to the bottom of this, hips square, core tight, shoulders are lifted. Abs are squared. Back heel is up. Wiggle the left toes. Now curl up. Straighten out the back leg, but keep that bend into that front left leg. So that as you take it down, woo, hover. Exhale, breathe. Breathe. Breathe it out. Come on, Monday, right here. Final leg exercise onto that left leg. Grab onto it. Ask yourself, have you given yourself everything that that left leg can contribute right here? Right now, that booty should be feeling it. Woo! The back of the glute just going. Here we go. We got 20 seconds left in this full range. I want you to start thinking upper body right here. Start thinking about that upper body. Start thinking about that control. Woo, that reach out, reach, we got just six. There we go, hold it. Bicep curls in, in, squeeze. Take it right back out. So as you hit those bicep curls, use that knee beneath you, hip square. Slowly take it out. Again, it's just that left leg. That right toe is light, the right heel lifted. We are stacking ourselves. I want you to find your left heel right here, push into it a little bit more. Should fire up that left foot even more. Woo. Those final 30 seconds, throw it out, flip those palms. Three, take it down in two. One, pull it up, pull it up. Squeeze, hold, take it right back down, there you go. Use that arm, use that row. Pull with it, take it right back up, go squeeze. Squeeze, drive with it, Woo. take it right back down. Amazing work, you guys, hang on to it. Hang on to it, breathe. All the way through the finish of this movement. Maybe you tap that knee down one more time because we go up just once more. That final hold, hands to prayer. Take it in in three, two, hold here, hold here. All right, guys, we got scrambled eggs. Scrambled eggs are happening. I'm gonna keep my hands into this band. Keep that band around my left foot. Going right into that tabletop in three. Scramble legs in two, one. So I keep it around my band. Hand goes down so my foot stays into that band. Pushing it out. Right into that tabletop. Now, I'm gonna let my left foot drift down the way. Slowly pull back. Squeeze, use that left oblique. Reach, hold. Take it back out, squeeze. Woo. There you go now. If you have a hand weight, Bend the knee, put it in between the calf and the hamstring and still use that left oblique right here. Otherwise, we're reaching. You're mimicking that scrambled egg so that as the foot goes out, we don't fall over to that right side. We pull ourselves strong into that left oblique right here. Good, you guys, hanging on to this right here. Squeeze, tall. Fold it in, fold it in to that left side. Take it back out. There you go. Do you feel a little extra credit? The little extra love onto that left leg. It's there for you this morning. It's there for you to work for you. Squeeze. Now that right hand is optional. You can take it up. Fold it up if you want a little bit more. 20 seconds. Let's go right here. Squeeze it out. So what I mean by not falling over to that right. As that left goes out, don't let that hip sink over. Keep it straight. Keep the crown of the head reach long. Hold it back in. We hold this next one back for me. Hold it back in six. Reach it long in three. Two, reach your right arm long. Reach your left foot out. Stay with this, come on. Control it, both feet are gonna go into that band. Tailbone, torso, twist. Woo! In three, keep that handle. One, okay. Both feet into that band. Taking it in. I'm gonna twist it over to that right side. Using that left oblique to push. Plant the 
heels right here is perfect. You can do this with those hand weights. If you don't got that resistance too, but it's a great way to twist through that torso. A little bit more on level two, drop it back. Take it hot for the feet. Squeeze, pull it back and in. Reach, breathe, go again. Woo. Take it over, hold. Take it back and squeeze. Squeeze. Stop center, come on, push with this right here. Left oblique, fire up. Moving into this here, don't let it go. Stay on to it, stay strong, breathing right here. Shoulders out the ears, core tight. You got it. Here we go, here we go. Lock it over, hold it over for me, three. Hold it over for me, two. One, hold it right there, stay right there. Good, you guys, you got it. Hang on to it, breathe it out. Woo. We're gonna choke up onto that band right here. You stay right onto that tailbone if you got it. We're going right into that band and soul train for me right here. We get ready. In six, leave the right foot in the band, take the left foot out. Get ready, we twist. Three, two, let's go, twist it. Twist it, pull into that left oblique. Right foot is in that band. Left foot, goes free. Twist through that waistline right here. So again, my left foot is free. So that as I push away the tension with the right, that's when I'm pushing against it, pulling against it into that left side. Twist it out. Pull it in, it gets lighter on the right. Twist back through center. Pull it over, soul train. Drive. There we go, there we go. Squeeze it out. Woo! Right foot is the band, left foot is free. Now modification, you can plant that right heel. Just twist onto the left. Right here, that is a perfect modification so that you are holding into that left side. Hold center. Just twist to the left. Otherwise, both directions happening here. Final 20 seconds. Woo, fire it out. Squeeze it out. We're gonna keep that resistance too. You give me a kneeling shoulder press and aim. Hold it over right here, hold it to the left. Pulse, squeeze, pull against that band, left only, fire. For three, kneeling shoulder press, two, and one. Okay, band. Come underneath. Use those hand weights if you got them overhead. Press. Squeeze. Reach it up. Take it out. Breathe. Woo! Here we go. Here we go. Stay into it right here. Good, you guys. As we use that upper body to strengthen all the way up, pushing through the heel of the hands, get the elbows out wide. Pull the core in. Squeeze. Push all the way up. Woo! Take the elbows out wide. Slow it down right here. There we go, push that core. Push that core, belly button back to spine. Relax the jaw, relax the face. Take breaths right here, slow controlled breaths. All the way out. Woo. Breathe it, squeeze that upper body. These next five movements, it's all we're gonna ask to be super focused into that upper body. Slow it down. There we go. Last 12 seconds just into this kneeling shoulder press. We're gonna keep those arms up. Right into those triceps. In three, two, drop it back. Tricep extension, reach, reach, breathe it up. Take it down. Always have that option here to separate the hands for a little bit more of a challenge. A little bit more of that balance. So we pull all the way back through. Staple down the shoulder blades back and away. Get that gap between the shoulders and ears. Press it, press it tall. Woo. Take it right back down. You got this right here. Again, you can always put those hands back together. But what's not happening is those elbows are not flying out there. Squeeze tight. Find the gap between the shoulders and the ears and lift up. Try not to let those hands feel like they're coming forward. I want you to feel like the back of your pinky, the back of the edge of that hand. Push it all the way up. Squeeze, squeeze. Draw it right back down. You got this here. 20 seconds, go slow. Stay, stay pull yourself down into the floor. I want you to feel energy come from the floor all the way through the crown of the head. You got this here. Last 10 seconds. Breathe it. Breathe it. We take it out right into that hug a tree. In four, take those arms wide. Three, two, hold. Now hug it out. Hug it and squeeze. Take it right back 
Take it back and squeeze. Pull it in. Breathe it. Find those 90s. Come on. Soft bend into those elbows. Good. This is that inner ballerina right here where you let everything go into that posture. Woo. Find that breath one more time. Sometimes all it takes is slowing that breath. Take a deep inhale with the arms wide. Exhale. Out through the mouth. Pull the abs in tight. Keep the elbows up. Shoulders down. Inhale. Reach it long. Keep that soft bend right here. Breathe. Here we go. Woo. 25 seconds. Just into that chest right here. Hang on to it. Breathe into it. Focus. Put energy into those fingertips right here. Okay. Here we go. Last eight. Get ready. We're going to go ahead and flip those palms in three, two, flip them up. Right back and squeeze, squeeze, hold it, hover, take it out, reach. Woo! Breathe it, there we go. Remember the biceps, the front of the shoulders are fighting for this right here. You guys are going to feel this strong because of those bicep curls we did in that super lunge. Go for it, reach or get as much as you can out of this right here. Stay with it, stay with it, reach. Pull it right back in. There we go. Nice work, you guys. You got this here. Stay for it. Stay for that fight for five. Woo! Hold it out in three. Hold it out in two. One. This is the only one. You can be one inch pulses in an inch. Out an inch. Hold. Let it shake. Do not drop your arms right here. You got this. You got this. Here we go. Breathe it in. You are strong. You are able. Last eight. Woo! Hang with it. Breathe with it. Left foot this time comes into that band. We got that band in soul train on the left. In three, two, one. Okay, so left foot coming in. Choke up onto that resistance too. We're alternating right to the left right here. This time it starts to emphasize onto that right only as you push the left heel away. Squeeze over to that right. Take it out center. Take it out. Hold it, breathe, twist it back. Twist it back. Reach. Good, you guys. Remember modification. Left heel down. Just pull into that right. Twisting over to that right. Reaching it back center. Twisting over. Pull it in. Reach it back center. That's a perfect modification. Level two. We push opposite direction. As the right heel goes long, the right elbow twists. As the left heel pushes away, the left elbow comes over. We find that squeeze, that tightness into that right oblique. Resist it away. Woo! Breathe it out. There we go. There we go. All right, it's 15 seconds here. We're going to center everything out. Taking that tailbone torso twist. Just over to the left. Both feet come into that band in just another eight. Hold this next one. Hold it. Breathe it over in three, two. Hold it. Hold it. Squeeze it. Little pulses into that right. Six. Pulse it in. Squeeze it out for three. Both feet to that band in two, one. Right here. Both feet to the band. Now remember, you can always just twist to the left and keep the heels planted on the ground. That's perfect. You roll the shoulders out of the air. Get that long line. Tailbone torso twist. Twist it over. Take it right back in. Otherwise, you can lift those, cover those feet. You gotta drop the shoulders back even more. Reach the arms out. Squeeze through that waistline right here. Woo! Breathe it out. Push over. Breathe. Squeeze. I want you to let that gaze follow those fingertips. Long spine right here. Good, you guys. You got just another 20 seconds. And we're going to take that panel, placing it in the right hand, keeping the band onto that right foot as we hit that soul train. Onto that right. We got just another six. Just another four. Hang on to it. Stay with it. Hold it. Hold it. Breathe. Think where you're going. Put your right hand into that with both handles. We get ready. Left foot untucks in four. 
get me ready for school or Friday to that. Hello, where are we going? Scramble eggs in three, two, one. Okay, sometimes those don't leave. So my right hand stays into that man. Right foot stays onto it, folding into that right leg. So going right into that scrambled eggs. There we go. Woo! Scrambled eggs right here. So you think about, you're stirring it up, you're bringing in that tension, you're pulling it right back out. Reaching long. This one, it is so important, that tabletop. So start in the tabletop. Then kick the left foot all the right foot all the way out. Now from there, fold. Squeeze it, pull it in, take it right back out. Reach, breathe. Woo! Here we go. This is it for those obliques. All right, Monday. You've officially done every single movement of class. That means the last 10 minutes we're going to go ahead and take into that right leg, that final piece of core. Stay with it. Breathe it out. You've got 15 seconds here. Maybe you lift, hug that left hand. Wherever that challenge is for you here, hold it back, reach it long in three, two, hold it. Hold it right here. All right, think about how we finish. Right into that super lunge. We bring both those hands into those bands. Woo, super lunge on the right in three, two, one. Okay, right here. My right foot comes forward. I'm gonna come out for you guys right here. Right foot comes forward. Left foot back, go down, hover, hold. Take it back, now squeeze, squeeze. Pull that biceps in, take it out, reach it. There we go, it's just that work. We're evening out into that right leg. Nothing extra. Woo, those biceps get that little burn. Let's go, drive through, push through. All right, that heart rate picks right back up. I know those arms are crushing into this Monday. We did a lot of focus into this here, into that upper body, but they got work to do. We got this final super lunge to get through for that full body. Fires up the right, back into it, drive through, drive through, squeeze tall. Take it back, down, breathe. Woo, reach those arms long for me right here. Because you guys, this challenge at the bottom, we're gonna change it rather than that bicep curl. Flip it for that row in three, two, row it, three. Center out, 15 seconds right here. Push into that right heel, square the hips. Good, you guys, I need you to go right back to where you were. When you decided you were gonna take 45 minutes for you, what were you doing, what was that motivation? You set that alarm, you got out all that equipment, got ready to move. And you coached yourself through this whole workout. When nobody's watching, when you still ask the most of yourself right here, that is so dang impressive. I need you to keep it. We go back to that full range. Keep that row. Tap that knee in three, two, final 30 seconds of a super lunge right here. Keep that back heel high. Drop it low. Breathe. Hold, hover, do it again. Squeeze. Pull those inner thighs towards each other. Get the elbows wide. Yes, you can, Monday. Come on right here. Let's go, let's go. Woo! Two more. Two more. We fire it out. Taking it down to the floor. We got a mega donkey kick. That light resistance band coming around the left knee. The right foot in three. Hold it right now. I need you to think where is that band? Where is it going? We go to that transition. Mega donkey kick in two, one. Okay, we get off right there. Light resistance band. So again, how I like to get into this, take the band around both feet, put it around the left knee, come into that tabletop position, kick it out, reach it long, right into that tabletop, bend it in, four, three, two, hold, push it back out, squeeze, Woo! there we go, there we go, you flex that foot, you flexed it so hard like you were pressing that heel. Into that foot pad, that curve bar. Press it away. Turn the knee, face it out from you. Pull the abs up and in, push the hands away. Make your right hand a little bit firmer to keep the shoulders squared to the ground. Make sure that left knee is not in front of that hip, it is directly beneath you. That tabletop is so important. Remember, every movement in Ligri, every movement we do has a base movement. That non-negotiable, you're in it. You're in it right here, that tabletop, come on. As you press out that leg, stop before it locks out. Stop right before it locks out, then take it back and in. Woo! There we go. But you guys, do not underestimate the work of that upper body. 
pull into that back pocket. Nice, you guys, you got it here, press. There we go, last eight. Woo! Hang on to it, do not let it drop, you've come way too close. You guys are here, you are here that last quarter, plus that last pass. We get ready, we push it all the way, full range in three, two, go, go. Squeeze, squeeze, stop before it locks out, pull it in. Drive into it here. How high can you get the outside of that right knee right here? How square can you get that tabletop? Do not fall over into that left side. Keep that knee out, bend. Push it right back out. Woo, for 10. Stay here. Where's that heavy band? We're going right into that baby skating. There we go, that sun is coming out. It's gonna be beautiful, abs tight for four. Here we go, baby skating in three, two, Woo, that shake though. Okay, find that disc. Foot to mat, band to quads. Pull it on. Get there in three, two, push it. Push, take it in. Woo. Push it out, reach. Now I got a flat foot onto that disc right here. Because as I'm pushing out, I'm pushing down through the outer glute, outer thigh right here, right into the top of the booty, pull the abs tight. Push it out and away. Squeeze. Slowly taking it right back in. Remember, this is here. This is it. This is how small it's moving. My foot is moving four, maybe five inches. As it does, the power of the work comes from the top of the booty onto that right. So that as you push through the outside of that heel, it's that big toe is never, ever going to come heavy. Woo. Center it out, breathe it out, push. Now make sure the tailbone, crown of the head are reaching opposite direction. The abs are pulling in, the shoulders are backing down away from the spine. There we go, push, 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 drive. Use your abs to control the tempo on the way back in. Use the press, the resistance, through that glute to push it out. Hanging on to it, guys, you guys, you got it. We're here, little two inch pushes. Little two inch pushes here in four. Hold it halfway. Three, two, hold it there, down an inch. Out one, hold. Do it again, go down an inch. Out one, hold, little two inches here. Woo. For two, push it right back out. Squeeze it, squeeze it here. Little two inches. Ooh, that booty goes on my right there. Come on, push through this right here. Good, you guys, this is it for that heavy band. Little press, hold. There's a stop between each one. You got this here for full range. Three, two, go full range, full range, squeeze, squeeze. Woo, there we go, there we go, breathe it. Abs in tight control, stay here. It is so deceiving, it looks like the smallest movement, like nothing happening, but everything is so focused into that little workspace. You got just another 10. We ditch that band, escalator lunge. This is gonna be your last exercise of class before that final plank in three, in two, in one. Here we go. Sometimes I love finishing with those legs. Finishing with those legs right here because you hold it all the way down, hold. That heart rate gets to pick up for me right here. Put that thumb underneath that right heel. Get high on that back toe, now drag up. Squeeze up, pull up. Stop before the top, take it down. You gotta stay even. Remember that energy, that push, that power you put into that left leg to start it out? Can you find that drag through that right leg? Take it right back down. Breathe it out. Squeeze it out. Hands are off that hip. Everything is focused in right here. This is that last lap. You can see that finish line for me right here of class. Everything you got gets left right here in these last few moments. In these last few presses where we have those two challenges and we're gonna rock them. We get ready, you hold it down. Meet me for those two inches down at the bottom in three. Two, don't move that back foot, just press through the right heel, up one. Do it again, up two, down one. Woo! Down two, stay with it, up one. Come up higher on that back toe. Take it down, home. Take it down. Woo! Breathe it, breathe it, breathe it. Yes, you can. If you're with someone, you say you got this. Hold on to it. Yes, you can. 
everyone else with me, I will not quit on you. Hang with this here. We go full range. We reach those arms in three, two, one. Climb. Climb. Stop before you lock out that leg. Here we go. Woo. I need this feet drop right here. Let's go. Come on, Monday. Push with it. Let's go. Stay with it. Dance it out. Come on. Stretch it out. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I love you guys. You guys are awesome. Oh. Um, what was it? I need someone to send me to it. Like, um, there's like some like meme or something, or like there's some like cartoon where it's like, I kick my own ass or something like that. And I need that because I feel like that. Sometimes I come in here and I'm like, what? Why am I doing this? <laughs> oh, I'll take you guys to take a huge stretch all the way. Inhale up. Oh, take it over, fold it over. Oh, we're just gonna stretch it out right here. Breathe it. Take it up over, alternating right to left. Take it over, reach. Oh, alternating, open it up. Flip it over. Going right to left. Oh, here we go. Oh my goodness, Monday, Monday. Who do we get to work out with today? Shout it out, where are we from? Where are we going? Thank you guys, thank you guys. All right, fold it, reach it, reach it. Oh, going right to left. My hips are popping, everything's going. One more each side, and we're gonna go ahead, hold it over to that right. So take, do me a favor, hold it all the way over, reach the left, hand over. Reach your arm, face towards the leg. Oh, take it down. Stretch it down to that right leg. Whatever you are, flat back, squeeze with it, hold. Woo. There we go, take a huge round stretch, wrap it all the way up and over. Other side, tilt it, turn towards it, drop it down. Oh. My goodness, feels good to move that body. Good, you guys. This time, walk those hands towards center. 
Reach the right hand up. Take it up. Bend the left knee down. Oh, twist it that way. Switch it up. Cross it over. Right hand down. Bend the right knee. Take it up. Grab those elbows a little side to sides. There we go. Slowly rolling it up right here. We're going to take those three roll ups right here. Huge roll up all the way. Melt it down. Roll through that back. Press through. Roll up, stack one vertebrae at a time. Take a deep inhale. Ooh, roll it back down. Hold it, press through. One more time, one more time, all the way up. Hold it, roll it down, press it through. Put the hands down, lock the feet together. Both feet together. Press down, reach to the ground, just let it hang. Maybe wrap those hands behind it, give it a ball up, stretch through the back of the shoulders. Oh, come all the way down as you guys coming down in that seated position. Feet come out in front of you. We grab those three things. Step Monday, so important. We grab that gratitude to move with. Take a minute, inhale up. We're going to take three things we're grateful for. Breathe in each one of them. Fold it over, lock it in. Breathe it up, fold it, drop it over. Woo. Stay with it, take it down. Hold it all the way down. Slowly rolling up one vertebrae at a time. Roll the shoulders out of the ears. No matter how big or small, when we move with gratitude, that love for ourselves, that love for others, that space coming from thankfulness. Whew. It's just a better way. Better way to be. Slowly taking it right back up. Thank you guys. You guys make me a better person by being able to move my body, to be able to just talk through and be so grateful for this opportunity to, to start my morning off with you. Thank you so much. You guys, as always, stretch it out, breathe, drink lots of water. I hope you guys have the best, best Monday. I'm gonna answer any questions if there were one, if you're popping off, of course, you guys. Oh, what's up, Nashville? Oh, <laughs> you guys are good. Oh, perfect. <laughs> So good, so good. You guys are awesome right here. Okay, no questions. I love it. I love it. I'm gonna um, go walk the pepper super, super quick, get some work done, and I'll be back at 5:30 if anyone's crazy and wants to run it back with me right there. But um, you guys are amazing. Mwah. Be well, and I'll see you soon.